today we're going to learn a little bit about a big machine. This is a Lincoln Power Mig 255C. Nice machine. Tell a little bit how it works. This is our gas. Normally you need to run the pressure between 25 and 30 psi. This is argon gas. Here's your wire. Over here's your leads. This right here, goes through there. That's your ground. This is your positive, goes up through the trigger and out. There's a wire feeder. This uh, pushes our wire down the tube. Now let's turn it on. Already set to where it needs to be for welding. Now let's shut it and go in the booth. In here we have the mega gun. Tell you a little bit about how it works. Yep. We have an insulator. This goes on like this. This insulates the collet body from having to uh, touch all the other stuff down here. This is a contact tip. When that wire touches this contact tip, which is powered through there, it gives the wire the electricity that it needs. And that's where the electricity comes from. Tighten that up. And now let's see if it works. Just like a dream. And now, last but not least, we put on the collet body. Normally when you put that on, you want it just, you can see from the side angle, and look in, it's maybe about an eighth of an inch above the top of the contact tip. You don't want it too far either way. You don't want the contact tip sticking out and you don't want the contact tip to be too far down in there. And that's about just about how the, the make gun itself is put together and just a little bit how it works. Another thing is when you're running MIG you want to have your line as straight as it can be. If it's, if it's all wound up and kinked up, you're going to have problems welding. In this next video, we're going to learn how to do a 2F bend test. That means horizontal. So stay tuned.